Hi, welcome to Bearded Meeple. Dexterity games. They've been around for a long time. Crokinoes from 1860, and people still play it today. Well, now, there's a new sheriff in town. It plays 2 to 10 people, depending on teams, ages 8 plus, in about 45 minutes. It's brought to us by Pretzel Games and Z-Man Games. It's Flick 'em Up. Let's take a look at it. So in the game, we have a rule book and a scenario book. We have a number of buildings and obstacles that are going to get in the way of our movement and shots. We have a movement token, shooting tokens, outlaws, and lawmen, and we have a number of tokens that will interact as our players play the game. The game is played in rounds. The town hall clock will signify any rounds remaining. There's a box to hold a token for each character you're playing with. It'll hold their amount of life and anything else they're going to be using for that scenario. When you use a person in a round, you flip their hat to the other side to show that they've been played. They're not able to be activated until the clock moves for the next round. There are three things your characters can do. Move, shoot, pick up, leave, or exchange something. When it comes to moving, you take the token and place it where your character was. You give the token a flick, and you're able to move your character to that position, but only if you don't hit anything. If I had hit the barrel or the cactus, the move would be unsuccessful, the action lost, and the player stays where he is. As I didn't hit anything, I'm able to move him ahead. For his second action, I'm going to shoot. I place the token off his hip. If the bullet simply grazes the opponent but doesn't knock him down, it's unsuccessful. You actually have to knock the opponent over to take a life from them. I've hit the opponent. I would take a life from the board, place it in the bottom of it. If a person is hit three times, they're out of the game. Depending on the scenario, different rules will enact. There's rules for entering a building, shooting from a building. There's even a shotgun you can get for getting a better shot at your opponents. Pete, I think it was time you were put down. And that, my friends, is Flick 'em Up. This game is going to be the king of dexterity games. The artwork is beautiful. The components are really good quality. It takes skill. There's certainly strategy involved. They offer different scenarios in the book to play, which is a nice touch. Overall, it's just a fun play experience. I really honestly hope you get a chance to check this one out. I'll talk to you again soon.